Cranial cavity and meninges. Three membranes constitute meninges of brain, dura matter, arachnoid matter, and pia matter. Arachnoid matter is connected to pia matter by many fine filamentous processes. Dura matter. Cerebral dura matter or cranial dura is strong fibrous and of two layers, outer endosteel and inner meningeal layer. Superior sagittal sinus, subdural spaces and subarachnoid space. Skin of the scalp, periosteum, bone of the skull, periosteal meningeal, dura matter, arachnoid matter, pia matter, arachnoid villus, blood vessels and fox cerebri. Outer layer, also called endosteel layer, it is really the periosteum lining the inner surfaces of skull bones and is commonly referred to as endocranium. Some features, it is continuous with periosteum on outer surface of skull. It provides seats for cranial nerve which fuses with the epicranium. The dural sheath around the optic nerve fuses with the sclera of eyeball. It is loosely attached to inner surface of the skull cap vault and formally to the base. Meningeal vessels pass through this layer to supply bone. Inner layer, it is also called meningeal layer. It is dura matter proper. It includes brain and the foramen magnum becomes continuous with the dura matter surrounding the spinal cord. It is separated from arachnoid matter by subdural space. It also forms dural folds or dural septa forms of dura matter, fox cerebri, tentorium cerebelli, fox cerebelli and diaph diaphragma cellae. Fox cerebelli, cerebri, separates two hemispheres of brain is located in the longitudinal cerebral fissure between the hemispheres. Tentorium cerebelli exists between and separates the cerebellum and brain stem from occipital lobe of the cerebrum. Fox cerebelli. It is vertical dural enfolding that lies inferior to the cerebellar tentorium in posterior part of the posterior cranial fossa. It partially separates the cerebellar hemispheres. Cellar diaphragma. It is the smallest dural enfolding and its circular sheath of dura that is suspended between the clinoid process forming a partial roof over hypophyseal fossa. The cellar diaphragma covers the pituitary gland in this fossa and has an aperture for passing of infundibulum and hypophyseal veins. Superior sagittal sinus, inferior sagittal sinus, fox cerebri, tentorium cerebelli, transverse sinus, tentorial notch, superior sagittal sinus, tentorium cerebelli, transverse sinus, fox cerebelli, occipital sinus, straight sinus, fox cerebri. Tentorium cerebelli, fox cerebelli, occipital sinus, transverse sinus, straight sinus, fox cerebri, superior sagittal sinus. Blood supply of dura. Inner layer more fibrous and requires less blood. Outer layer richly vascular and provides nourishment to adjacent bones supplied by following artery. In the anterior cranial fossa by the meningeal branches of the ophthalmic, anterior and posterior ethmoidal arteries and a branch of middle meningeal artery. In the middle cranial fossa by the middle and accessory meningeal arteries and by the meningeal branches of the internal carotid and ascending pharyngeal arteries. In the posterior cranial fossa by the meningeal branch of the vertebral and occipital arteries. Nerve supply. So Supratentorial dura, ophthalmic nerve, infratentorial dura, sensory innervation rich, supplied by in the anterior cranial fossa by the anterior and posterior ethmoidal nerve and receives some wings from maxillary nerve. In the middle cranial fossa by the meningeal branch of the maxillary nerve, in the anterior part and the meningeal branch of the mandibular nerve, nervous spinosum in the posterior part. In the posterior cranial fossa by the meningeal branches of the vagus and hypoglossal nerve. There are, these are the C1 and C2 fibers carried by the cranial nerves. The dura mater around the foramen magnum is directly supplied by C2 and C3 cervical nerves. Thank you.